Our brain is an essential organ which controls everything we do, think, and feel. Key to the brain function is a constant supply of vital bloods rich in oxygen and nutrients. Without a steady supply of bloods, brain cells would die. The circular arteriosis, also called the circle of Willis, is a junction of several important arteries at the bottom parts of the brain. It helps blood flow from the both front and back sections of the brain. The circle of Willis gets its name from the physician Thomas Willis, who discovered this part of the anatomy in 1664. The circle of Willis is important because it allows blood to flow across the midline of the brain if an artery is occluded. The circle of Willis thereby serves a safety valve function for the brain, allowing the flow of blood through an alternate route to take place if the flow is reduced to one area. The brain is supplied with oxygenated blood by two major sets of arteries, the internal carotid arteries and the vertebral arteries. The vertebral artery is much anterior to the brainstem and forms the basilar artery. The basilar artery then branches laterally, giving rise to the posterior cerebral arteries. These arteries form an important anastomosis or a connection with the internal carotid arteries. This connection is called the circle of Willis. At this connecting point, the internal carotids branch upwards and laterally, becoming the middle cerebral arteries. And finally, two arteries branch superiorly from the middle cerebral arteries forming the anterior cerebral arteries. These are all the primary arterial branches responsible for providing blood flow to the brain.